now that the weather's warming up, the last thing you want to do is to spend hours inside cooking. That's no fun. Katie Lee Beagle, co-host of Food Networks. The Kitchen has a simple sheet pan recipe. It got more than a million what? views when she first posted yes. it. Is this a viral recipe? Wow. I mean, people love salmon, it turns out. True. And they love sheet pan recipes. It's easy, right? Can yeah. I say that this is probably like my go-to Monday night recipe? Because mm -hmm. we mm -hmm. always try to get back into kind of healthy eating on right. Monday. Yeah, it feels like, like a healthier recipe and it's so easy and fast. And I love a sheet pan because there's very little cleanup yes. as well. I'm not into doing dishes. No, no I'm Neither with you. <laughs> and, you, and you can get the whole deal onto one, like you get your yeah. veggies and exactly. your all of it. Exactly. And great. Now, how's Iris? You have a two-year-old. Oh, Iris is great. We have such a good time with her. She's so much fun. There she is so with cute. her wild hair. Come on. <laughs> you feel like you've changed as a chef because of her? I, I do. I, I feel like I'm always looking for easier, faster recipes, too, because at about 5 o'clock, yeah. it, like, gets chaotic. Yeah. Yes. You know, she's, like, wanting something to eat, and <laughs> I feel like I can't get the food out fast enough, so I like something that I I can just kind of throw together totally. and that everybody's happy. And she's a little bit of a picky eater. She, with y'all as oh, parents? It's really not fair. No. <laughs> But she'll change. I feel she like will. all two-year-olds yeah. are oh, that way. It's, I mean, the broccoli, I, I kind of don't even bother. We like to eat the broccoli, and I put a piece on her plate, because that's what they always say, put yeah. it on the plate. And she goes, yuck, mommy, and takes it you right You know what off. we that's have, normal, which, which yeah. it's called the Paris test, mm -hmm. that if our kids don't try foods, then they're never going to get to travel with us. It's just oh. called the good old-fashioned uh, threat. Oh, oh. And that'll you know, work, threat. too. That'll yeah, work. I, I think it you works, like that? I mean, she's it? two, it's a little early, but we can do it. We'll threaten with ice cream Okay. Let's Put this to work. To okay, this. so all you have to do, chop up some broccoli and some sweet potatoes. You want your sweet potatoes to be in cubes, and your broccoli can be, you know, a little bit on the medium side sure. because you want everything to cook at the same time oh. on the sheet pan. Okay. Uh -huh. So instead of buying fillets of salmon, we're going to just do one big piece. And do you so ask them at the, the supermarket to de-skin it? For this recipe, I do. Most of the time, I cook salmon with, with the, the skin, skin on. on, but for this this one, because you'll see we're going to add a sauce to it, I like it skinless. Okay. So I'm going to add a little bit of oil to our Super veg. Simple. Yep. And some salt and pepper. Salt and all I did pepper. was in there. And yep. pepper that salmon up for me. Ooh, fun. So that's all we're doing to it. And then we're going to make our sauce because this is a honey mustard. Ooh. I didn't even tell you all what we were making. <laughs> honey, honey mustard <laughs> salmon Yum. with sweet potatoes and broccoli. Oh, so I've got gosh. equal parts of honey and I like to use a, a like coarse a mustard. Poupon? Yes, nice yes. <laughs> Very oh, good. Sense. Speaking yeah. of the Paris test, right? You're getting yeah, ready totally. for your travels. <laughs> exactly. And then make Mix it together. This goes right on top of the salmon. I mean, so simple. And some of it's going to run off, and that's okay because we're going to mix that with our veggies. So Willie, take those veggies mm -hmm. and scatter them scatter. all around. Can I touch them. What's the, yeah, what's the protocol yeah, nowadays? For it. You washed your hands. Yeah. yeah, I washed earlier. All right, so that's going to go into the oven. Oh, and I put parchment paper on because that makes our cleanup a lot easier. That's Remove. smart. Oh, that's yes, very smart. yes. Yeah. Then you're barely you won't have to use Scrape any it. elbow cream. Yeah. 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 All right, so put that in the oven, 425 degrees. It comes out like this. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's very easy. We love it. How Iris long, how long salmon for 425? Too. About 25, 30 minutes. Now, if you want to do this in fillets, cook your broccoli and sweet potatoes for about 10, 15 minutes first, then add your salmon fillets and cook it the rest of the way. Okay. Because it'll be a different cook time. All right, so you want to have some leftovers for lunch of yes, that we salmon. Do. We're going to make a little salmon salad here with a lemon caper vinaigrette. Oh, I love capers so Me much. Too. Yes, Me so too. we've got our Here's lemon. Let's put a little zest in mm. there and some capers and Dijon mustard. Mm. Salt and pepper it up. Sure. Little splash of white wine vinegar here. Wow. Whisk it, whisk it, whisk it. And then we're going to come down here to our salad. How beautiful. I've just got bib lettuce. I've got thinly sliced celery in here. I've always got celery in my fridge. Some cucumbers go in. Good cutting, Jenna. You know, you can kind of just use good. what you have. No, that's you good. Said that. No, that's real and good. Uh, <laughs> Jenna, you said you don't cook much. You're doing a great no, job. Well, I, I assemble. Assemble. And I okay. chop. Mm -hmm. All right. We got chives. By the way, does parsley. your daughter eat cucumbers? Not really. Okay. No, I she can't will. get a vegetable she in her. She will. Occasionally sweet potatoes, occasionally avocado. Okay. All right, so we're going to add our salmon in here. You just flake it up after it comes out. And you can also use canned salmon for this if you didn't make the recipe. You okay. know, canned salmon's a great thing to have around. If you want to add these veggies to it, you can. If not, have it right on its own. 
Looks Ooh, beautiful. Add the dressing yeah. wow. to it. I've got some down here for you guys. Yeah, we're coming okay. to taste. Thank you very much. Come taste. Did you get one though? Have That's... a bite. This or is yours. mine. Oh. <laughs> she has the bowl. I, I like, out of the bowl. I like large portions of salad. <laughs> I call it my trough salad. I just. <laughs> You just eat straight out of it. There, huh? Yeah. Mm. Excellent. So tell me what you think. That is delicious. Light and fresh and mm. easy. So and you have that light. for dinner, oh, so this for lunch. How that incredible. Really, really good. Okay, I, I'm going to take that home to my kids for dinner if that's okay with you. Delicious. I hope they eat it. Um, before we go, though, we have to talk to you about a passion project of yours. A food bank here in New York. Yes, food bank for New York City. I've been working with them for years. Um, I'm on their board, and it's just a great organization. We do a project called the Woman to Woman Campaign mm -hmm. um, for raising awareness for different products that women need. It's a, a great thing to raise awareness for. Good How for awesome. You. Doing good work, as always. For this recipe, by the way, and trust me, you want this recipe, go to today.com slash food. Thank you, you. Thank you, Katie. Thank you, Katie.